Hello and welcome to Day Z, a place I thought I would never be. This is where the adventure has started for me, in a town where I cannot see. Oh, woe is me, I feel something is watching me. Okay, that's not cool. Heard something. Ah, oh, zombies! Come on! I don't want to die right off the bat. Help! I'm dying! The heck? I'm punching your freaking face in your. Oh, help me. Oh, okay. Ah! Another beanie. Go, 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 go! I don't know how long I can sprint, but I'm not looking back. I know how horror movies end. I ain't doing that. Okay, I'm looking back. Are you kidding me right now? It's still chasing me. I don't like this. I don't like this. My, I can feel my blood dripping. All right, so I'm already screwed. Next. The heck, another zombie. <laughs> Dude, there's another one. Holy shit. Okay, so inventory, I'm guessing, is I. So if I take my shirt off, tear into rags. Whew. All right, I'm good. Thanks for the tip, guys. Bandaging myself. I'm no longer bleeding. Suckers! Zombies, you ain't taking me today. Oh, another zombie! Ah! So as you can tell, the first few minutes of Day Z are not necessarily going my way. Running through a town, hunted by zombies, bleeding. Yeah, yeah things aren't looking up for me. Now, I'll have you know, this is actually the first time I've actually ever played Daisy, as well with a couple other friends, and we are all on comms together. Tata is the most experienced player of the group, and he's doing a good job of training us all over the comms, telling us the controls and whatnot. So with this does come a fair bit of chatter. However, with this series, I'll do my best to kind of keep that out as much as possible. My future plans for these series is to actually find another way to record the audio that goes over comms so that I can have a little bit cleaner audio on the other end. So this series of videos is actually just going to be following my friends and I as we just jump in here to DayZ standalone and survive as long as we can. So for all you DayZ fans out there, I hope you enjoy this series. Enjoy! Alright, well I've survived the zombie apocalypse, I lost a lot of blood fighting them off, but all in all, I'm alive, and that's good. But now comes the daunting task of exploring houses and trying to find something to keep me alive. Because I am freezing cold, I'm thirsty as all get out, and I'm about to die of hunger. Now as I search through these creepy buildings looking for the needle in a haystack that's going to save my life, unfortunately you can tell that my skills here, my survival skills, are at an absolute minimum. I'm not even sure how to use a flashlight at the moment. Luckily I managed to scrape by. I find myself a can of soda and a t-shirt. So that puts me in a good enough position to move on to the next task. Trying to figure out where in the world I am. It's, um, I would say it's about quarter mile from the water. I mean, I could look down the road and see. Okay. Uh, go to the church. I, I need you to go to the church, and then I need you to kind of look around in the area. This won't be, like, you directly just... next to the church. It'll be within, like, the block that the church is on. Okay. He might be in, uh, Electro. He's either, he's either in Electro or he's Get up in, on the uh, hill. Chair. You know the hill I'm talking about, the, the sniper hill. Get up there. Hold on, this might not and... be Electro. Here's a How really many easy one. Does Here's work? a stupidly easy one. Rothgar, in your city, do you see a really, really tall building? Kind of like a hotel. All right, we... Yeah, we're down at the coast right now. Just through these trees, good. We'll be at the coast. We're gonna stay in the woods as best we can. So yeah, this was the moment that I realized that I'm pretty much hopelessly lost. However, there were a few perks along the way. While I was climbing up this firehouse here, I was able to get some more loot that's gonna prolong my life just a little bit longer. I was also able to determine that the water is probably south of where I'm at. So with that bit of knowledge and my bit of gear, I decided to head west and just hope for the best. And thus began the long and arduous trek. With the water on my left as a guide, and just enough fuel inside me to get me from one house to another, I pushed forward in hopes of finding my friends. If I could dream of a nightmare that I'd love to never have, it would have to be this, forced to explore houses by flashlight in a zombie apocalyptic world. Yeah, 
At this point, daylight could not come soon enough. And as if the evening wasn't going bad enough already, unfortunately, some grim news had come across the comms. The vine himself had become sick, and we did not know how to cure him. But as the evening's events would continue to evolve, maybe a little sickness isn't all we should worry about. There's gonna be any antibiotics. So... What do you mean? Like, it's still saying I'm sick, and... Don't keep consuming them. Uh-oh. How many have you taken? All of them. <laughs> oh my god, Divine. Oh my fuck. Are you kidding me? I brought duct tape. <laughs> <laughs> oh, <laughs> he took all of them. Hey, Duck, come here. <coughs> I need to talk to you. Yeah. <laughs> this is not good. Still so oh, oh, whoa, 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 Divine's characters went, oh, <coughs> <coughs> made weird coughing sounds. Oh, God. I'm sorry. Oh, Divine, why don't you stay really far away? No, 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 you stay further back. <coughs> I don't, I don't want none of that. Come on, man, let's be friends. Why am I always the one that fucking gets sick? Every time we play this shit, I'm early. always the one that gets sick. Stay further back, you're too close. I don't want to die. So yeah, I just want to spread age to you. Okay, probably. <laughs> Divine, you know, pretty soon here, I'm just gonna spray you with the disinfectant. <laughs> you know, maybe, maybe you'd stop being sick if you drink the disinfectant. Yeah. Ooh. Drink so Rothgar, where you? are you? Don't worry. Alright, so we gotta find a long sleeve shirt for Divine. Yeah, hey, where's Rothgar? You know, Why isn't he talking? He might have walked away. He's sucking out of the mountain, dude. There we go. So he's that's probably now. Keep heading west. What the? Woohoo! Holy crap! Oh, that scared the crap out of me. Oh. <laughs> what? Dude, what I What scared you? I walked into a house. These things are chasing me right now. I turned on my flashlight, looked down, and two zombies came out of the floor. Oh, that's fun. Yeah. Oh. In front of us, you get the one behind us. Get the one behind us, go. I think he no, stopped. No, never mind. Ah, shit. Yep, the, the one behind us went after Divine. Well, Let's go, motherfucker! Hatchet time! Divine should have kept up with us. Motherfucker's fast! He's down. Oh, is that shirt? Pants. Where are you, bitches? Up. Firehouse? Where's the fire mm -hmm. station? Through the door. You ah, see me? Ah, shit. See you, Divine. Come on. Get a pistol in here. No ammo. Come for on, it. Divine. Dad! Come on. Back, you hell Come on. demon! Oh, <laughs> Hold on, I got this. <laughs> oh, he already killed it. Uh, <laughs> what the? Oh my god. No, I do hilarious. Fighting our way through the night, we managed to survive, if only by the skin of our teeth. Unfortunately, as if it were the Oregon Trail, we lost the vine to the cold. And good? Well,. Somehow he was abducted by aliens. However, it was not all bad news. My plan to move west along the coast was actually working out because I was about to make contact with my first human that wasn't actually a zombie. I see a bridge. Oh, okay, okay. That's that's good. Can you still see the uh, the big rocky mountain? It's behind me, yes. Yep, okay, go across the bridge. You see someone? Rothgar? Yeah, oh, I see you now. Is that you? Hi, buddy. I'm not alone. So there you have it. Against all odds, I have survived the night and made contact with the tut. Things are now starting to look up. At any rate, if you like this video, make sure to hit that like button on the way out. That's really going to help me out. The comment section is below. Let me know what you think about this episode. This is a totally new thing to my channel here. At any rate, thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next episode. Have a great day. Peace.